Hey everyone, in this video I'll be showing you, or not really showing you, just talking about what is some of the best practices on using Product Hunt to um, uh, launch your product within it, some things that you may need to keep an eye out for, and just how to go about it, and what are some things that you need to know before you actually start uh, launching your product on Product Hunt. So first, let's talk about what Product Hunt is and then go about how to uh, launch your product and some things that you may need to keep an eye out for, like I said earlier. So Product Hunt is uh, this platform, ProductHunt.com. Think of it as a community where people uh, launch their products here and then there are there are like members within the community that are upvoting products, sharing them, uh, giving uh, a name to the product, meaning, they, you know, they just share it with other people and giving it more and more attention. And it's a daily thing where people upload products and then daily you'll be getting fresh um, products here uh, that are future, just like the ones that you are seeing in this home page right here. So these products are the most upvoted products for this specific day that we are in. Tomorrow they are going to update, refresh, and then there is going to be a, another set of products that are filtered based on uh, upvotes, comments, that kind of stuff. And obviously you, your goal within Product Hunt here if you are a uh, launching your product within here is to be among these people that have their products within the first few pages uh, from uh, this daily uh, featured products. So uh, let's say first, how does product hunt work? There's the makers that are the people that are actually launching the products in the community share what they have built by hunting or submitting their product. They call submitting hunting, so you can just be more familiar with the terminology around here. So products are hunted by community members daily, and others in the community, just like I said, can upvote, comment, and share those products as they compete on the home page leaderboard for top spots. So ideally you want to be within the top spots so you can get more recognition for your product, uh, it's kind of simple and a straightforward idea that is implemented really, really nicely within Product Hunt. And I really applaud Product Hunt team on this uh, platform. Including Product Hunt, uh, including product of the day. Okay, so this is, they say, you know, you want to be in the leaderboard for top spots and you can be product of the day, which is a thing also. And then you can also read the full guide if you want. There are more questions that you can read, but we don't really want to delve into how it works more than uh, what you should be doing in order to be within these top spots. Now, I think like most of them, I think all of them are actually software products. So you just know. Uh, I, I believe there's a possibility of a hardware product. I'm not really entirely sure, but uh, most uh, most are software products, if not all, actually. But you obviously you can just create an account, and once you create an account, they will give you a grace period of uh, seven days uh, where you can just you know uh, communicate with the community, uh, be a part of them, see how things or for one week, you can really launch a product within one week. It's a free, um, a free account, by the way. But after this uh, one week, you'll be able then to submit your own product within here. And then you just follow the steps, link to the product, that kind of stuff. And you obviously will need to uh, promote it as much as possible and do as much research as possible, which, which is what I'm going to help you with here. I'll be telling you a lot of things that you will need to know before starting, which will affect how uh, your product is. But before before any of that, obviously your product needs to be good. It's, you can't really, like you can promote a bad product, but you can't make it 
to be like one of the top if it's actually bad you need to make sure that it is actually very very good and i'm not talking about top notch type of like excellent product here but just you know polished uh product really because like if it's a really bad product no matter what kind of research you will do it's, no, it's still not going to be featured within the daily products so uh now that we talked about this let's actually go to my notepad where i have some info about some things that you need to keep uh in mind before launching your product so let's read through product hunt best practices here are some things to keep in mind before launching your product and i have taken this info from experience of others and people just that have been using this platform for a really really long time and this is what um like this is the summary of it so first uh gather feedback in advance because this is a very crucial step like i said a few minutes earlier if your if your product is not good if it's if it doesn't really function well then like no amount of promotion is going to have it uh, be up there i'm not trying to discourage you here but like try to get as much feedback as possible beforehand uh from a group of friends uh, or so, some kind of user base and then afterwards you just improve it and then you think about actually launching it uh on sites or platforms like product hunt so share your product with a select group of users or friends before the launch to gather initial feedback and make necessary improvements what i suggest if you don't really have anyone to um test the products for you you can actually go for um uh, uh like freelancing platforms where you can find freelancers you may need to pay a little bit of money for people to actually test uh professionals not just random people professionals to test out your product tell you everything that they have tested and give you a very very excellent feedback uh and then at the end it's going to help you a lot yes you will be paying money but uh you'll be getting a lot more and it's going to be worth it because once you have um improved your product then when you launch it hopefully it's going to be a successful launch and you'll be getting uh, a lot more in return so second tip that i have for you which is very 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 important and a lot of people stress this uh, a lot timing matters choose the right time to launch based on your target audience's time zone and online activity and most importantly you will need to keep in mind weekdays and weekends weekdays tend to be more active than weekends so uh by research most active days are tuesdays and uh, wednesdays so this should help you i'm not now this is not a go for the most active day situation it's it's going to be dependent on you if you are really confident with your product then by all means go for it if you're not so sure i would suggest as a beginner uh, you go for the less populated days so weekends uh, for you to not have so much competition because like the largest uh, product makers that kind of stuff they're going to be aiming for obviously uh, weekdays most likely tuesdays and wednesdays because it does have more activity and it's going to have a lot of competition so if you're really confident go for it if not then i suggest you go for weekends and launch on around 12:05 that kind of that kind of time around that time am pst to not lose any time for potential upvotes because like i said it's daily and this is when it starts so you don't really want to miss out on any time okay so prepare a compelling pitch uh I guess this is self-explanatory you just need to point out everything the highlights and what uh, kind of problems your product solves and the key features in a really organized manner uh, create engaging media media always helps not a lot of people don't like 
reading books without images and uh, this is going to help so create as much media as you need or want it could be videos it could be pictures um, or screenshots as well it really is going to be such a booster for your product and preparing for launch day be ready to engage with the product hunt community on the day of the launch there are going to be comments so make sure that you are ready to answer as many questions as possible for that day that day is going to be busy so be ready for it respond promptly to comments and questions to show your commitment to user interaction and then social media promotion if you've got followers use them wisely because it does help a lot if you have a lot of followers go for it so share the product hunt launch on your social media channels to increase visibility and encourage your audience to participate and then seven which is the last thing i will note uh iterate based on feedback this is going to be after the launch obviously so you'll be using the feedback received on product hunt to iter iterate and improve your product which is the most important part of this entire journey improving your product to be better and better and then obviously getting more score um, you need to remember that product hunt is a community and genuine interactions and value pr uh, propositions tend to resonate well like i said uh like the better you are with communication with the community the higher chance you'll get more upvotes uh nice comments about your products great feedback and you really need those to be a future really so just be genuine uh, with your product um, show how you are enthusiast uh, enthusiastic about your product and just tell them why your pro product is the best out there really just go for it and people will always just recognize genuine interactions and they value them and you will succeed with that by following these best practices you can increase your chance of successful launch on product hunt hopefully and i hope also that this video helped you a lot because i really wish you a great uh, product launch on product hunt and don't worry about it product hunt really helps you out here so i think of, again just i just want to stress the idea that you need to think of it as a community where you just want to show people your product you're happy with it and get as much um not just of upvotes and stuff, but most importantly, uh, feedback. So I hope this video helped you. And thanks for watching.